Minute Math, Minute Math. When you need help, you use Minute Math. Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're learning about solving rational equations. Solve each equation, and remember to check for extraneous solutions. So, if I was given this problem, x minus 4 over 6x plus x squared minus 3x minus 10 over 6x, and say that's equal to x minus 1 over 6. Well, I notice all of these have the same denominator except for the right. We just have a 6 here. So to fix that, we multiply that part by x over x. We should get a 6x in the denominator. Okay. Left-hand side, same denominator. Let's add them together. Combine, we get a 6x in the denominator. Okay. In our numerator, we just will add our like terms. No x squared. x squared there. Negative 3x and a positive 1x and a minus 2x. Negative 4 and negative 10 and a negative 14. Here we have x minus 1. And actually we're distributing it, so x times x is x squared. And x times 1 is an x. x squared minus x. All over 6 times x, 6x. X. Now, if I take this denominator right here, and I multiply that to both sides, which I'm allowed to because it's being divided by. These will cancel, and so will this. Makes it a much easier problem to solve. x squared now minus 2x minus 14 equals x squared minus x. Bring all of our like terms together to the left, subtract the x squared to both sides, and hopefully you can see they cancel, right? That actually makes it easier. We add an x to both sides. And we have, well, negative 2x plus x is a negative x minus 14 is equal to 0, which is left over on the right. Get x by itself, we add a 14, both sides, negative x equals 14, and so x equals a negative 14, right? Multiply both sides by negative 1. So they tell us, though, that we need to check this, right? Check that answer, okay? So to do that, we take our original equation, and we plug in negative 14 in for x, and see if the left and right-hand side are equal to. Negative 14 minus 4 over 6 times minus 4 plus negative 14 squared minus 3 times a negative... Oh, see, again, negative 14. Don't forget that 14. Minus 14 minus 10. If you caught that, let me know in the comment section. 6 times negative 14 equals negative 14 minus 1. Why do I say 14 weird? Over 6. So, let's simplify. Let's get this part here. Negative 14 minus 4 divided by 6 times a negative 14. And this as a fraction is 3 over 14. Plus here, negative 14 squared minus 3 times negative 14 minus 10 divided by 6 times negative 14. And that, as a fraction, is negative 19 over 7. All the way to the right, negative 14 minus 1 divided by 6. And as a fraction, it's just negative 5 halves. All right, so we'll see if this equals negative 5 halves. 3 divided by 14 plus a negative 19 divided by 7. And we get a negative 5 halves here. So the left and right hand side are equal, making our final answer here, the negative 14, true. So here we have a final answer, x equals a negative 14. Minute math, minute math, when you need help you use minute math. Minute math, minute math, when you need help you use minute math. Minutemathtutor.com